come back into town. I am very tired today. I think I maybe got like two hours of sleep last night. And we have very something very exciting going on in the back seat of the car. Let me just hop out really quick and I'll show you what's going on. Okay, what? I can't see. Are you graduating from fifth grade, Charles? Yes? Cutie? So first order of business after coming home this morning is this one right here. <laughs> You're so cute. Say hi to everyone. Hi. Are you graduating from fifth grade? Yeah. Are you excited for middle school? Kinda. Yeah? Not really. <laughs> well, you can still have your friends. Not all. Not all your friends. Just like three. Well, I think you make friends very easily. What it's like? Just think, you didn't even know um, Callie before quarantine. That's because quarantine. Huh? That's because of quarantine. I know. Callie. It's crazy that her best friend now, we didn't even know before we had quarantine, right? So we're at the school, at the elementary school, and they're having a drive-by graduation drive performance. Say hi. <laughs> Whatever. And it's a drive-by, say hi. Yeah. So it's a little bit of a wait. So we're just kind of hanging out here. I mean, there's like 50. Yeah, we kind of got a line of cars. And we have a cute little balloon outside the car. Oh, uh, here's all your teachers lining up. So. sleeping off my emotions today or something because I'm just exhausted. I think I mentioned earlier today that I kept falling asleep at my desk, sitting up. Yep, you did. Right, Chelsea? Yeah. <laughs> There's Chelsea. We're heading down to take them to their church activities for the night. Um, I had to take a five hour energy before I even got to work. Yeah, I, I could easily take a five hour, five hour energy. Maybe I didn't sleep good last night, I don't know. Waiting for me to get home, I don't know. I, I don't think I got more than two hours of consecutive sleep but I only went to sleep for four hours total. So, um, I think the dogs woke me up at like two in the morning and then I went back to sleep. Ugh. Then the alarm went off at four. But, um, we'll chat with you when we drop the kids off, but I just, and then I fell asleep on the couch after, I just, I when I got home from Chelsea's um, graduation thing at the school, a friend of mine stopped by for about an hour and we were talking and, uh, I said, I, like, I don't have anything I have to do. I, you know, I just need to, like... Live in the life. No, but I... Just, <laughs> That's nice. It's good to have a relaxing day. Okay. What? Yeah, especially after my mom just died. Like, it's not just any normal day. I understand. He's not being very sensitive to this <laughs> entire thing. It's not just a normal day of me not having something to do. Um, I just, I sat down and I just let myself fall asleep and it's like 6.45, I think I woke up an hour ago. And even that was like, do I have to get up? But I was starving, so I got up and I had something to eat. But anyway, we have officially planned our first beach days, girls, next Wednesday. If you are an old follower here, um, an OG, you know that we do um, beach days during the summer down at the lake. And I'm very excited to have my friends start that up again because it's just, it sounds so refreshing to me to just sit in the sun, talk to friends, and let the kids the play. The Washington version of Hawaii. It is the Washington version of Hawaii, yes, Chelsea. So I'm very, I'm looking forward to that. That's normal, except we haven't done normal through COVID. So it's like even better to have normal makes you realize and with loss you realize that the normal is actually really really good. Can you hear that? You gotta talk loud. I know I'm just gonna show them the rain. It's ready to rain. Torrential downpour. It doesn't look like it but it's raining way harder than it looks. Yeah. The sunroof up there. Well, you're gonna see it like oh, see sheets. It well, here, see yeah go out your window. Can you zoom? How do you zoom? Here we go. Look at all that rain. Can you see the kids running outside in the rain? Holy cow. 
on this, man. I mean, it's just like flooding down the window. And these kids are just playing outside. Ashley's like not. She's over there. They're gonna zoom in on her. She's right there in the blue shirt. She's smart. She's not coming out in that. And then the rain stopped. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that, you can actually see the window now. Look at that. It's only been like five minutes. That's insane. Check it out guys, we're driving home. It didn't even rain on this side of town. Like the sidewalks are completely dry. And this side of town is literally like Ooh. 10 minutes away, if that. Yeah. But by, if you could go straight that way, it's probably three miles straight that way. Yeah. Max. Max. Like it's just over that hill. Yeah, it's just through the like trees over here. So it's like. That's insane. It may not even be like two miles. Yeah. Straight that way. That's insane. Like total dry over here. Like it's up and over straight. All right. We've been home for a little bit. Got the kids in bed. Kaylee was over hanging out with her friends and then they went for a walk. Um, I was teaching Chelsea just now how to play Skull King. Where did it go? I learned this at my brother's house. It's this game right here. It's horrible light, sorry. Skull King. It's actually really fun, really strategic. So I'm gonna teach Abby how to play this tomorrow because I think that would be a really fun game to play. But I'm going to call it a quits and go watch Bachelor and <laughs> Bachelorette, I should say. Call it a night. Jason's already got a guy show upstairs. The only problem with my hair now is that I can't like, here I'll show you how much I can pull it up. Like that's as much as I can pull up. And it's like this little teeny tiny. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna take my makeup off and call it a night. Everyone's enjoying their shows or in bed. Chelsea and Ashley, iPads off. Love you. Two more nights of school nights. Um, I also have to sit down and, um, what did I say, 4%? That's not charging. Hang on. That's not charging my phone. Okay, I gotta charge my phone. But I am gonna sit down and respond to all your kind messages today. Um, there's another video I was gonna do. I was gonna film it here. Um, I haven't decided. Obviously I didn't film it today, so it's not gonna go up tomorrow but I haven't decided if I'm gonna film it at all. So, um, just take the next video as it comes and then you'll get to this one. But thank you for all your support. I'm gonna to respond to all your messages tonight as soon as my phone charges, because your comments have been very sweet and very nice and I really, really appreciate it. It's helping me get through. I think I've only nearly cried one time today, so I it's nice to have a normal routine, but then, as I see more and more friends and have more time to talk to them, it, it lets me like kind of release the emotions and I like that. I know that sounds dumb, but I want to grieve. I want to like, you know, go through that process so it doesn't just like bottle up inside me because that's not healthy either. So anyway, take care and I hope you guys are doing good. It's fun to have Chelsea graduate from fifth grade. Abby is technically graduating from eighth grade as well. She has a honk and wave drive by tomorrow and she's like yeah there is no way I'm doing that in eighth grade <laughs> I don't blame her at all I don't know what they thought what eighth grader they thought would do that but it's the only graduation they can get so that's what Abby will have tomorrow but thank you for joining us and we'll see you guys next time take care